so good. Oh, hi, didn't see you there. Was far too busy cooking some fresh hot cross buns. One of the best things about Easter, in my opinion. I'm here today to tell you about all the different things that are gonna be happening over the next few days in the life of Emmanuel Croydon. On Thursday at 8 p.m., there is a sermon by Jeremy Davis. You can also join us for a Christian Passover meal. All the information for both those things can be found on the Emmanuel Croydon website. Our Good Friday service is coming to you at 10 a.m. and we will be meeting various characters whose lives were touched by Jesus. At 11 a.m. on Saturday, we have our Messy Church Easter special with craft and singing and all your Messy Church favourites. In the evening at 8 p.m., there is Easter evening prayer. And again, the link for that can be found on the Emmanuel Croydon website. On Sunday, we'll be meeting at 10 a.m. for our Easter service. During our Easter Sunday celebration, we're going to have communion together. Obviously, we can't do this how we normally do it. So please have prepared something to eat and something to drink. Preferably, that could be some bread and maybe a little bit of red wine or red juice. But honestly, if it's some orange juice and a cookie, that doesn't really matter. We just want to commemorate and celebrate the death and resurrection of Jesus together. And we hope that this will be a really powerful way of doing that. How amazing that even in these really difficult and uncertain times, we can still meet together in so many different ways. One of my favourite books of the Bible is Philippians. I love it because it is a book that is full of hope and joy and perseverance. It's a book written by Paul, who is going through a pretty tough time in his life when he is away from his family and his friends. But of course, in those days, they didn't have FaceTime. So he wrote letters to the people that he loved. In chapter one of Philippians, verses three to six, it says this. I thank my God every time I remember you. In all my prayers for you, I always pray with joy because of your partnership in the gospel from the first day until now. Being confident in this that he who began a good work in you will carry it on to completion until the day of Jesus Christ. And I have to say, I am so, so pleased to be a part of this amazing Emmanuel Croydon community. So many people are showing the love of Jesus at the moment in so many different ways. And I am praying for each and every one of you with joy. And I hope that you are all remembering to be in contact with the people that you love at the moment, whether that is through FaceTime or through Zoom calls or maybe writing a letter. I hope that you're remembering to pray for the people that you love as well. Soon all of this will be over and we will be able to meet together again. And I cannot wait for that day. Until then, take care and know that all the good things that God has started, all the good things that are carrying on through this time will carry on afterwards as well. See you soon and take care.